Sweeney prays for compassion after his brother gets arrested for stepfather's death. Mm. I think this is a very complicated situation. Yeah. But I think we need to put it out there because a lot of people thought um, it was um, the guy, his brother, um, Slim Jimmy Slim from Jimmy, Ray's that, Yeah, but it's not. But it's, it's not. It's actually his half brother, Michael, the youngest. The son of this stepfather. Yes. Oh. The one they are yeah. arrested. Okay. So the stepfather the raised them is. since they were in middle school. Their mm. mom was part of the military. She moved mm. around a lot. And, um, when she got married to somebody else, he had two sons, mm -hmm. you understand? Mm -hmm. And he's actually the one who is suspect, who is the suspect, suspect right now, is, is the, the youngest. youngest. He's just 19 years old. This guy is 26. His elder brother, is, I think, is 28 or something mm -hmm. like that. That's Slim Jimmy. Mm -hmm. And, um, is not Slim Jimmy because a lot of yeah, people are people think, think, it thinking Slim Jimmy. Yeah, it's Slim Jimmy and Slim, Slim Jimmy, Jimmy is actually the, el is the, the eldest brother. of this um, Sueli. Okay. Do you understand? So, he's, yeah. and they're saying his youngest brother. Okay. Yeah. So, um, so, at the end of the day, people this. should know that it's Michael. So, yeah. the case Thank is. Thank you for that clarification. Yeah. yeah. And then the case is um, he has actually gone for um, psych evaluation first okay. and he has been released from the hospital and he has been arrested for murder. So, I think they have actually. Um, confirmed that he's that mentally he's stable. No, that he's mentally stable because they had, okay. um, went for a psych But well, is it confirmed that he was one who killed his father? No, he's not. No, he's still a suspect. Yeah. He's, he's innocent he's until proven right. guilty. Oh. So anything, there Trying could be a to twist to now and then he will come out. So yeah. it hasn't been confirmed, but he has been arrested for murder. Mm. Yeah. Do you understand? I so, think it's just a very sad way to start the year for Swahili. Mm. And again, looking at the fact that I'm, me personally, I'm just tired of all of these kind of situations where people are shot dead. And it happens a lot, especially in the black community. Community. I don't know if it is gangster related the violence. The gun control thing what. should actually come the to The gun play. control. I, I feel like in the United States of America, they should seriously start looking into gun control and they should limit the amount of people that are able to access these guns because the amount of people that are dying by being fatally shot, it's it's becoming well, even in much. Nigeria where we have gun control, let's look at the um, Abuja Ice, um, one, one of the robbers, <laughs> when, they were, when, they were, when, they, when they were into um, interrogating him and yeah. they said, um, the guy said that uh, getting a gun is not a problem. Mm. Do you understand? So I think some people actually find it easy to it get, get these maybe it is, like, no, maybe compared to Nigeria. Compared, compared to the US, well, it's still hard. In the US, you go to a store, a gun store, and actually buy a gun. Yeah, you have to be on that G. Yeah, so there are so many people that are losing their yeah. lives because of you know being shot being not shot i'm like that but i'm just wondering what the motive this. could be because it's on, it's really funny when they say oh somebody killed this father killed but it is mother. not confirmed that he was the one who killed his dad though it's possible that maybe he well they said he's the, the only person of interest right now that is there's no other you guys will have to keep watching the yeah space. the space yeah, and we'll see, see how the story develops look at the nigerian guy that stabbed the sister his pregnant sister to death to the um nfl no the texas university football mm. player that start the sister to so I'm wondering how people can actually take the lives of their own family members because mm. I think that's where the highest love didn't, is supposed to exist. Didn't Ken kill Abel? Abel? I mean, come on, what is the, the okay. highest love? Ken killed Abel. I mean, do you know the story? Do you know the story? story? No, no, no. Oh, you do. Not that come much on. Of <laughs> 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 like, it might be very, very so. shocking sometimes. The people who who might be your greatest enemies can be those who are around you because I watch a lot of like IDX. Um, um, all these crime stories. Investigation. The first people they suspect when somebody dies are the people around them, their family members. And they're usually, the they're usually the... And they are usually the culprits at the end of the day because they're the day. ones who have more access to you. So mm. when something Especially when happens, you watch a lot of CSI and um, CSI, you, get, you, see when you see all, all of those things. things and you, you realize know. that people kill people that they love for very, very weird reasons. So it's but I'm just surprising. wondering what the motive could be if it's actually guilty. People they are supposed to. Mm -hmm. yeah. But it's really sad and um, it's really a sad um, beginning of the year for, for Sui Lee yeah. and um, yeah. Slim yeah. Jimmy. Yeah. And in fact, the family at large, they are the popular ones. That's why we're talking talking about mm, this yeah. grief. True. Now, he, there's, this guy has another son, the late um, stepdad, has know. another son, apart from this one we suspected, do you understand, mm -hmm. who is older than both Sueli and Slim Jimmy and the rest of this them. This family feud makes me remember um, the, I don't know if you guys saw the story of the young man who said he brought out clothes for his, his, uh, sister to wash mm. and she didn't wash the clothes uh. <laughs> and there's a problem or something. <laughs> okay, that's like another story for another day.